Catch past episodes of Create, Build, and Manage Daily on Demand. Go to bizvod.com for details. My next guest is the founder and CEO of That Conference, which is a unique four-day technical conference for the whole family. Clark Sell is joining us via Zoom tonight. Clark, welcome to the show. Well, thank you very much for having me. Absolutely, we appreciate your time. I want to start with, where did you get the idea for this conference? You know, it was born out of traveling all over the U.S. and seeing how the different communities worked and uh, wanting to create a place where technical folks could be heroes to their kids. So could you create a uh, safe family fun place for uh, what we call geeks and geeklings? <laughs> Well, I like that because it would, it, I mean, what jumped off the page at me when I was researching uh, for the interview tonight was the fact that you make it a point to say, bring the family, there's something for the kids. It's not just your normal tech conference. So I was going to ask you kind of a follow up question why include the family? Is it to be the hero? Or are there other reasons why you wanted the, the entire family to be part of this uh, particular conference? You know, at, at our core, we're a community first effort. And, you know, that means involving one's spouse. That means one's kids. Um, we all go to work. We all um, hear the stories at the dinner table. And uh, I feel like it's important to create exposure for kids. And what better of a way to do that when uh, you're kind of around your tribe of people and, and other kids who are um, experiencing the same thing. So um, it's very much about community. It's very much about creating exposure uh, to everybody. I like that, Clark, and and it's an industry that at times, and you, you probably know this is why you're you're wanting to go this route. Is it can be long hours. It can you can take a lot of time away from your family, and so getting them involved sounds really cool. Talk about the location uh, that this is at, because not only is it the family involved, it's a really fun location. Yeah, absolutely. We do it at a water park and that would be a non-traditional place to do something. Now, of course, we're not doing those sessions in a pool, but we like to leverage um, the entire scene and everything that's there. So we uh, we hosted the event at the Kalahari in Round Rock, Texas, and uh, have fun. Like you learn and play. And I can't think of a better place for uh, something like that to happen. Yeah, we got some pictures of, of the conference here. Um, what are some of the things that people can learn? And, and by the way, for those who are listening to the podcast, the name of the conference is, quote, That Conference. So when you hear me say that, I'm not being generic here. That really is the name of the conference. So what are some of the things that people can learn at that conference? Yeah, if you're professional, then it's it's anything related to software development or software engineering, um, you know, from web development to mobile development, anything in that kind of creative space of actually doing and building. If you're on the family side of things, um, it would be anything related to STEM. So, you know, that could be as simple as making a paper airplane or how to get started in the programming. And of course, there are some kids who are, you know, in some of the adult sessions as well and learning how to do um, exactly what they're doing. But at our core, it's a community and it's centered around, you know, software development. And and Clark, do you have to be working in software development to go to this conference? So if a viewer is watching tonight and they're interested in technology, but they work in another field, can they come as well? Absolutely. Yeah. This, this, that conference is for everybody. It is it is meant for people of all ages, obviously family included. Um, and whether you're, if you want to call it a junior or new or new to industry, if you will, to those who are, um, you know, seasoned professionals and maybe on the other end of the spectrum of them, they're the ones giving the, the learning to somebody else. So absolutely, anybody and everybody is invited. So we got your main website. We're going to put that on the screen now. It's that.us, that.us. And as we're looking at this conference, is there a direct uh, website to the conference? I think you were mentioning uh, just before we got on the air. Yeah, you can go to thatconference.com because why not make the internet confusing? Um, <laughs> but thatconference.com takes you to both of our events, one in Round Rock and the other in July in, in Wisconsin. So both at the same Kalahari, well, I guess two separate Kalaharis, but both at the Kalahari, both at a water park. 
And and do you have the dates already set for the uh, 2023 camps? Absolutely. The Jan January will be in Round Rock, so January 15th to the 18th, and then July, the end of July will be in Wisconsin. Okay, so, so January and July, both annual events. I love it because I was just thinking, uh, I was thinking this was just a summer thing. So you got the one in Texas, which makes sense because winter in Texas, I mean, so water park in January, though, that's still kind of interesting. What's the deadline, Clark, to, to sign up for the one in Texas? <laughs> January 15th. Oh, you, tickets are on sale until January 15th. Okay, so you can literally walk up and get your ticket and walk in. Absolutely. Okay. Now, you may want to book your room a little earlier if you're going to stay, but <laughs> uh, we can certainly uh, take tickets all the way up to it. Now, when they buy tickets, do they buy it as a family or individual? How does the pricing work? That's a great question. We have both what we call professional track and a family track. The professional track, their tickets are a one price and then the family uh, spouse and kids tickets are another price and whether or not you want food included changes the price of that. So we try to make sure that it's um, encompassing of all, um, if you wanna say distances, you know, some people travel in and we have discounts on on rooms whereas other people could drive locally and, uh, and maybe don't need the food. So we try to cover the spectrum. So technology is constantly changing. So what kind of preparation goes into that conference to prepare? Because it's a big step when you when you step out and say, we're going to teach you these different tracks and technology. You have to be on top of your game. Yeah, you know, we spend every day of the year um, you know, working with the community, uh, we have an open call for speakers. So our speakers are are people who submitted to speak and, and educate others. Um, we mentor a lot of folks uh, throughout the year, uh, kids included. We have a, a number of kids who speak at, at both events. Um, and since we are community first, that means the community gets to help pick the things that get uh, that get selected and chosen. And that's uh, that's really important to your point. It is ever changing. Uh, and with that, when you have this large community of people who can help uh, curate, if you will, what's there, uh, you kind of have a good pulse on the dial. So we're, uh, we're really happy the, the feedback loop that happens, you know, throughout the year. Well, Clark, I appreciate you coming on the show tonight and putting that conference on our radar. And again, the Texas date is coming up in January and then again in the summer in Wisconsin. For more information, you can go to their main website. It's that.us, it's .us, that.us. Stick around, this is Create, Build, and Manage Daily.